All right, so in this video, I just had a question. I was making a chart for somebody and I mentioned, I noticed that we have the same incarnation cross. And her question was, what does that mean? How do I know what that means? So, uh, and, and actually we're at different profiles. So our actual incarnation cross is slightly different in description, but for starters, what that means is what I wanna show you right now. The incarnation cross is made up of the top two gates on either side. I guess if you're using an, an MMI, uh, um, which is an extended chart from Jovian, you um, have a different configuration. But the point is, is it's the sun and earth of each of each of the the conscious and unconscious sides. So black is conscious and red is unconscious, and Sun and Earth of her chart and my chart as well um, are 27, 28, and 41, 31, which are the gates that are referenced here in the in the chart. So 27 is here, 28 is here, and you can see that they're both black, which means they're conscious. And then 41 and 31, 41 is down here, red, and here in red for 31. So those four gates make up our incarnation cross, which is also 70% of our design. And so it's, um, it's a substantial amount of our definition. And what we, there's a lot of information in there as far as um, sort of destination once we're of our, of our potential. So it's, the idea is the more we lean into being ourselves and living our designs, the more potential uh, un is uncovered and we, we walk this path that we're built for, which our incarnation cross describes. Okay, hope that helps and have a great day.